Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Comedy up back with another Dokkan battle video and today we're gonna try something a little bit different and take on the pure Saiyans category super battle road stage with a Vegeta only Vegeta's family team and I know some of you guys might be thinking right now Tiger why are you doing this and I guess my only answer to that is because I'm bored. There's literally nothing to do in the game right now, at least on global, and I don't expect anything new to be added to the game until sometime next week, so I thought it'd be kind of fun today to just change things up and try something we haven't tried before. So anyways, let's jump in guys. This is the team we're bringing with my one dupe, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. I know it's nothing impressive, but you know what, I'm very proud of him. And uh, aside from that, we have LR Majin Vegeta with a single dupe as well. We have my transforming Vegeta, who has two dupes, both of which I pulled on the LR Gohan banner instead of LR Gohan. So, uh, you know, totally not salty about that. And we also have Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta with three dupes, so almost rainbowed there. And this guy, Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, the Extreme Z Awakened one, is going to be an absolute beast. I expect him to be the MVP of this team. And we also have a Super Saiyan God Vegeta here for some extra tanking, and uh, his damage is not bad either. So, actually, you know what? Let me let me see if there's any better options. Let me just uh, consider all my options here. I think out of what I have left, he's probably the best. I mean, this guy's not bad either, even though he has no dupes. Um, hmm, let me think. You yeah, know, you know what? Let's bring him. Okay. So anyways, that's the team, and luckily we were able to find a Rainbow Super Saiyan 3, but or Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta friend, and uh, I'm super stoked about that. 17 crit, 9 additional, no dodge. Uh, I mean, I would've went for the dodge, but that's okay, man. Alright, let's jump in. Let's see what happens. Um, <laughs> just to be clear, I'm doing this mainly for the fun of it. I don't know what exactly to expect from the team. I mean... I know it's gonna be good, I know it's strong, but I've never, you know, attempted this before, so we're going in completely, completely blind. Let's see how this goes. Um, let's throw this guy in the front, and... Um, you know what, that's fine. Yeah, these guys don't really link too well right now, so we're gonna pop the Whis. Actually, no, let's pop the Icarus, just to be safe. Safety first, as always. And let's go for Trunks here. Alright, got the Ultra Super off. I love how much key Vegeta gets, man. It's awesome. And, okay, we'll go for him again. And then we can actually attack with the Vegeta too. Um, I believe the Vegeta can stun, but it's only when you're facing movie bosses enemies, right? Which I... We, are we facing any movie bosses in this stage? I don't, I don't think so. So unfortunately, I don't think we're going to be able to use his stun. But um, he can, he can still tank. He is still a pretty decent tank. His damage is actually not bad. We got the we got the counter off. I love it. I love it, man. I know him being rainbow doesn't increase like the chances of countering. Um, but sometimes it feels like it, man. Sometimes it feels like a rainbowing unit does increase their ability to like just do like counters and dodges and stuff like that. I I know it's like superstition. Wow, we're almost like this trunks is almost dead. That's crazy, man. That is crazy. We've been getting a lot of, like, good RNG, though. We get a crit. Oh, no crit. Additional? No additional. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Um, Trunks is dead next turn, guys. Yo, Trunks is, like, dead dead next turn. I think so. I mean, just to be sure, maybe I should... Maybe I should actually attack him with the Vegeta here. I don't know if I want to. I kind of want to stun... Goten... But I'm also a little bit scared. Uh, you know, let, 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 no, let's just screw it. No, let's go for Goten. Because I believe that I screwed up. <laughs> yeah, I think I screwed up. Wait, wait, was there a way I could actually get Vegeta, like Majin Vegeta super off? I don't think so. I might have screwed up. I don't really know. But yeah, <laughs> we. I think we messed up these orbs, guys. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll give him that. And at the very least, we can go back to Trunks here with the LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. So I think he's still dead this turn. I think he's still dead this turn. Okay, all of our mistakes will be forgiven if we actually stun this Goten. Please, but thank you. Yes, yes, okay, Goten stunned. Don't have to worry about him anymore. Um, just don't super me, Trunks. Uh, don't super me. 44k, I can take that. 
I can live with that. Damn, 44k for a regular attack, man. Oh my god. Alright, Trunks, can you die? Thank you. Vegeta just killed his own son. <laughs> it's okay, though. It's okay. Um, gotta teach these kids to be tough, you know? Alright, so he's stunned. Uh, I'm not too worried about him, but I definitely want to keep Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta in rotation, so I think I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna keep transforming Vegeta and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. Uh, let's actually give these orbs to... Transforming Vegeta. And then we can actually... Can we get the Super... Ultra Super... Yeah, there we go. And then some extra attacks from Super Saiyan Blue Evolution. Ah, it feels so good, man. It feels so good to have like a rotation where there are no attacks coming because the enemy's done. Like you, you just know you're good no matter what. And we're getting, wow, another like back-to-back -back super from transforming Vegeta. You know what? I was being really, I was being like super sarcastic uh, when we first started this because I was like, you know what? Like those two dupes of uh, the Vegeta could have been my LR Gohan, but. You know what, seeing this right now, seeing this right now, I'm actually a lot less salty. Like, legitimately a lot less salty than I was when I started the showcase. Uh, this dude's a beast. This dude's a monster. Okay, um, we're gonna leave Majin Vegeta at the end there, just like, do his own thing, you know, like... <laughs> definitely not gonna put him back in the line of fire. Uh, maybe we could just stun, maybe we can stun again and I just don't have to worry about it. But, yeah, um, Majin Vegeta can... Stay at the end, you know, stay safe from the attacks, and uh, just, you know, do his crazy damage that he does, man. Okay, yes, another stunt. Man, this is awesome. This has, this has been a very, very good RNG run so far, man. I think this game likes me changing things up, likes me running these, like, themed uh, decks or teams, and I feel like I'm being rewarded for it right now, man, because this is going... I don't remember the last time one of my super battles they just went this well. Like legit, like I don't remember the last time a run has gone, you know what, let me just shut up right now. I'm gonna shut up right now because I'm about to get supered like five times in a row after this. All right, one item, all right, one item, beat that stage, crazy RNG, I love it. Yo, if you guys haven't tried it yet, try out a full Vegeta, Vegeta's family team on Pure Saiyans or like super, um, super type only, I guess, but I'm pretty sure Pure Saiyans is quite, it's harder, probably. I don't know, I haven't, I haven't played the Super 1 in a while, but I'm assuming the Pure Saiyans one's harder. So uh, take a full Vegeta team onto the Pure Saiyans uh, stage and see how you guys do. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys beat it as well. Um, if, you have, if you have a half decent, like, Vegeta's family team with the LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta as lead and, like, a rainbow Vegeta friend, I think you should be fine. Like, there's no reason you shouldn't be able to beat it. Okay, let's pop the Icarus again. Same strategy as last time, safety first. Um, and I guess we can go for Gohan or Go Tanks. Um, I, I mean, we don't have type advantage. We do have two AGL guys later on. Um, you know, I'm gonna go for I'm gonna go for Gohan because I think we can kill him faster. So if we kill Go, oh crap! I do this. I don't think I can super with the Vegeta later. Who do I want to super with more? Actually, I think my transforming Vegeta will probably do more damage. Um, yeah, with because he has more dupes, right? And yeah, okay. So we'll go with this. I really like to talk to myself a lot. If you guys haven't noticed <laughs> for these runs, and uh, he can just get the one orb here. Okay. All right, all right. Let's see some some more good RNG. Give me some additionals. Give me some crits. Uh. <laughs> Let's have a repeat of the last stage, all right? Repeat. We got a crit. All right, no additional. We got the crit. And uh, that Whis is put... I mean, the Icarus is putting in work right now. All right, 1.5 mil from the transforming Vegeta. And give me additional. Ah, uh, no additional. No double supers like last time. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, man. This is going way too well, man. I am actually concerned. Um... You know, because, like, things don't usually go this well. You know what I mean? Let's try to stun, let's try to stun the, the, the Gotenks. And then we're going to go back to Gohan and keep working away at him. Oh, nice. We can actually super Gohan here. Okay. Okay, we're going to keep working away at him. I, I want to try to kill him first uh, before we focus on the Gotenks. Because um, the Gotenks will cause me more trouble, right? Like, I don't have any int units on this team, but that Gotenks will do crazy damage. 
to my te uh, to my AGL units, my AGL Vegetas. Stun. Oh my god, when was the last time this man stunned this much? I don't remember, man. I don't remember. I know it's a high chance to stun, but it 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 is a like in practice, it is a surprisingly low chance, right? It's a surprisingly low chance of stunning in practice. But not this time apparently. Not this time. And Vegeta with the with the guard as well. Yeah, I, I keep saying Vegeta and they're all Vegeta, so it's like, which one are you even talking about right now, man? Uh, I was talking about the god Vegeta with the guard. He, he has a high chance to guard against uh, all attacks, right? This is freaking dope, yo. Okay, do I have to item here? Maybe. May I don't necessarily want to, but maybe it'd be smart to item still. Um, don't want to get, you know, overconfident or anything like that. You know, I, I think we can actually, we can probably risk that last attack. But what if it's a super? <laughs> Damn, dude. Uh, okay, okay, you know what? We should be okay. We, we should be okay. Famous last words. Should be okay, guys. <laughs> okay, come on, come on, come on. If you're gonna super me, super me like in the front or in the middle or something like that. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, give me a crit. Give me an additional. Let's just kill Gohan here. Yo, if you just kill Gohan here, I'd be so relieved. Additional? Ooh, no additional. Alright, so as long as we don't get super for like 250k or something. We stunned? Are you serious? <laughs> Are you serious? We legit stunned. Oh my god, I love this guy. Alright, um... Dude, that's amazing. Should I even... I... Okay, so we have the act skill, but... Should I attack Gotenks instead of Gohan with the active skill? Um, probably, right? Hmm, let me think, let me think, guys. It's a big moment here, it's, it's a crazy time. Uh, I think we should go for Gotenks. And then just kill Gohan with, actually... You know what, I'm gonna play it safe, we're gonna go, we're gonna kill Go... Actually no, he's stunned, what am I doing? <laughs> it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Um, I'm gonna go for the stun, I'm gonna go for the stun after with Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta. Um... Yeah, and then if we stun the Gotenks with that super, then like it's over, man. It's just it's it's completely over. Okay, so we we'll just give him one here, and then let's take him that. So I, I know I know Super Saiyan Three Vegeta is not gonna take any damage, so we're fine. Oh, we're getting supered. Awesome, perfect. So we know we're not gonna super in the second in the second slot now. And then uh, yeah, if we stun, it's just. <laughs> Yo, this what is this run man another stun. What is this run? This run is absolutely insane. I love this man This team is so good. I okay. I knew the team was gonna be good, but I didn't expect everything to go this smooth It's, it's almost like the game knows that I'm filming a video and they don't want me to make a fool of myself or something which I am very liable to do on Super Battle Road and as I'm saying this, I'm realizing that like if I die, if I don't actually finish the stage, I'm screwed. Like I'm gonna look so stupid, right? <laughs> but come on, man. Yeah. It, this is going way too well, guys. This is going way too well. Okay, you take these. Um, no, you 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 you, do, you attack first. You attack first. That's what, what I'm trying to say. Like take what? I was like, we're not even giving them orbs. Okay, super. Uh, active skill, ultimate attack. Let's go. Give me a crit. Two million. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. Um, yeah, we can afford to give him these. And then you can take those. And wow, no super from... Oh, it's okay. We have type disadvantage anyways. Okay, I'll just give him these. Okay. This should be it, guys. This should be it. I'm about to go into the last stage with like six items active. Or uh, six items left. Six items left. This is... This is a crazy run so far. I, I don't know about you, man, but my runs usually for Super Battle Road do not go this smooth, man. And we're done. Okay, next up, next up. Who is it? Who is it? I, I forgot. I already cleared the stage once. It was like a couple days ago. Oh, yeah, it's Vegeta Jr. and Goku Jr. Okay. So let's take care of these two kids, and we are out of here. And we got the Dokkan attack. Ooh. Um, ooh, this is, this is interesting. 
I want a Dokkan attack with the Vegeta, Majin Vegeta that is, 3, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, um, but is it risky is the question, is it risky? I don't think so, I mean if we pop the Whis, we should be safe, right? We should be safe. Um, just to be safe, I'm actually gonna pop in Princess Snake as well. That's just how, how worried I am about that freaking Majin Vegeta right now. Okay. Uh, let's give him these. Okay. But he does not Ultra Super. And then I guess we'll go for the stun on Goku and we'll keep going for Goku. Okay. There we go, guys. Let me, <laughs> let's not screw this up now. Let's not screw this up now. Focus, Tiger. Let's focus. One, two, three, four, five, six. Beautiful. Man, that was that was tough. That was high stakes right there. Okay. <laughs> I'm excited, man. What's this going to do? This man's attack is at 2.4 million right now. 2.4 million. Ooh, 2 mil. Ooh, okay, not bad. It's 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 not bad. Okay, I, I was hoping like it would do a little bit more for the bar, but it got them to like almost half health, um, which I can live with. I can totally, definitely live with that. <sighs> I'm still gonna try to use like my items very. Uh, what's the opposite of conservative? I, I can't even think of the word right now. Um, liberally, I guess, like not be too stingy with them. Because man's not trying to go for like a no item run here or anything, right? <laughs> I'm, I'm just trying to, to beat this stage right now with this team. So uh, yeah, I am totally okay with you know using all my items still, even though it was a very very efficient run. Um, just so you know, we actually beat it, and I don't like make some stupid mistake and die. Okay, here we have yeah we're gonna we're gonna try to go for a Vegeta Junior first. Let's oh crap, no we have type disadvantage. That was dumb. Okay. Just one time. I'm gonna reset. Okay, so here is the one reset we are allowed. Alright, in this run. I just messed up real bad there. Had to uh, go back and fix our mistakes. Uh, I'm gonna put this back, this guy back. We still have the Whis active, I'm pretty sure. So we're gonna go for Vegeta here. Vegeta Jr., that is. Then we're gonna go for Goku Jr. with type advantage, obviously. Um, and then we'll go back to Vegeta Jr. for the last attack. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. 56, we're getting supered here. I'm gonna guess 50k, maybe? Please? Ooh, wow! Okay, well, at the very least, <laughs> it wasn't Vegeta, right? If Vegeta was, like, Vegeta Jr. was doing that, what type disadvantage against us, man? Oh, he doesn't have that disadvantage. Oh, wait, oh, for some reason, I thought he was physical. Why did I think it was physical? Well, anyways. That's okay. <laughs> right, we're still alive. I am a little bit concerned right now, though. Um, but we should be okay. We should be okay. Getting a little bit nervous now. Yo, that one super, I was like so confident, like up here, and then that one Superman just like shattered my entire existence. Uh, okay, let's see. No, 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 no. We're not putting that guy there. Um, I guess Majin Vegeta in the front is fine. Let's heal up with Princess Snake and get that 30% damage reduction. Um, definitely going for... Definitely going for Vegeta Jr. And possibly stun him, actually. And, uh... I guess we can keep going for him. I don't see an issue with that, necessarily. Yeah, um, let's keep, let's keep, let's keep going for him. And wow, I don't, I don't want to. Damn, dude. I want to save those orbs for. I'm gonna save those orbs. I'm gonna save those orbs. Let's save those. Mm, should I? No, let's let's try to kill him here. You know what? I was gonna save those orbs for Super Saiyan Four Vegeta, but I'm like, if the if the other Vegeta can just kill him here, then I think it'd be worth it. You know? Yeah, we we can probably kill him here. Yeah. No stun. That's okay. Uh, his health is low enough where if we get like, I mean, if we don't get an additional super, we still might kill him. But if we get like a crit here or an additional super, he should be good to go. Oh, oh, and there he go. Oh, no, 
And there he goes. Okay. <laughs> Yo, playing with my heart, man. Playing with my emotions right now. Okay. So let's see what's happening here. Oh, we got the active skills. What's happening here? Um, okay, so let's actually use an Android 8 here. You know, always better to be safe than sorry. And then we're gonna pop the active skill. Let me turn this up actually. Hold on. Actually, I just realized I'm not even recording the desktop audio, so you guys probably can't hear that anyways. My bad, my bad. It sounded cool though. It sounded really cool. <laughs> you guys already know, it's okay. Um, okay, let's let's not get too excited. Let's take our time here. We'll go with that. And then, wow, that's a lot, that's awesome. Okay, so this Vegeta might just finish it. That, that, might, that might just be it. Um, but if not, that's screw it, man. I'm gonna pop the Whis. I can just farm more Whises. I made a video today talking about where to farm all these items. Go check it out, guys. <laughs> Little self promo there. But yeah, I can just farm them up from the Resurrection F event. So I'm not too concerned about using them up right now. Um, better to be safe than sorry, guys. I don't know, man. I've gotten so overconfident in some runs that got went really well that uh, <laughs> and I died with like a sliver of health on the boss, man. Worst feeling in the world. I'll oh, see. He's still alive, guys. He's still alive. See, what if he super me here and I would have taken like 500,000 damage? Probably not, but you know. <laughs> I'm, I'm, hold on, I, I can actually do this, hold on. Final shine! Attack! Perfect ending to the perfect super bad. Okay, not perfect, but like as close to perfect as I've experienced in my Dokkan playing time. So, uh, yeah, that was awesome, guys. That was really, really fun, honestly. Like, Super Battle Road usually stresses me out, and especially when I'm filming, man, I I'm scared of like making myself feel like a, like a, look like a fool. But that was an absolutely beautiful run, guys. Um, I would add this guy if I could, but my friends list is full. Dude, thank you so much, Diamond something, for uh, that friend assist right there, the Rainbow LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. And that is going to do it for today's video, guys. That was freaking awesome. That was so much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, and once again, let me know in the comments down below if you guys ran this Vegeta team or something similar. Uh, full Vegeta, Vegeta's family team on Pure Saiyans, and let me know how you did. Um, as you can see, we did pretty damn well in this video. And uh, also give me some more suggestions, guys, about more theme team. Maybe like a Goku's like a Goku only, Goku's family team for Pure Saiyans, or um I don't know. I'm, I'm sure you guys have other ideas. I just can't think of anything off, to, off the top of my head right now. But uh, yeah, let me know in the comments down below, and I would love to make those videos too, because this one was a crap ton of fun to make. And uh, that's all I gotta say, man. As always, if you guys liked the video today, if you enjoyed it, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it, guys. That's all I gotta say. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.